A Central Kentucky gas station had to close this morning after several drivers say they were sold bad gas. And now Kentucky Petroleum Supply is inspecting the pumps. Those crews went to the Shell gas station on Camargo Road that's just outside of Mount Sterling. Our Whitney Wetzel was at the station today and has more from one woman who says the bad gas caused her car to stop working. We had to keep starting it up and putting our foot on the gas pedal and getting it revved, 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 and it would die as soon as you took your foot off the gas pedal. We'd have to start it back up. Amber Hoagland says she stopped to get gas at this Camargo Road Shell around 9 o'clock last night, but by the time she got home, she noticed something wasn't right. When Hoagland tried to leave for work this morning, she says it took 45 minutes to get her car to even start. Once it did, it still wasn't running properly, and she couldn't make it to work. I work at a job that has a no-excuse uh, policy, so Today is a big deal. I'm not sure if I'm going to have a job after this or not. When we got to the shell just before 10 this morning, all of the pumps in the store were closed and Kentucky Petroleum Supply was on the scene. When we first attempted to talk to employees, they locked us out and ran away from us. After a few hours, an owner finally told us water had gotten into the gasoline supply. Leaves had covered the drain grid and overflowed and went into one of our spill buckets on unleaded, which had, it had a defective drain in it, and it's gotten some water in the, in the no lead gasoline. Stamper says an insurance adjuster is now contacting at least four people who had car problems after getting the bad gas. In Montgomery County, Whitney Wetzel, WKYT. And we check with Hoagland, who says an insurance adjuster did call her. She says the damage will cost about $350.